Riverside weather with meteorologist Aaron Brackett. We have the edge of the clouds very close to Tucson as the sun was setting tonight and that made for a wonderful sunset. And you, our viewers, definitely followed through sending your photos to weather at kgun9.com. This is from Chelsea Bishop of tonight's sunset. Larry Wazlewski, one of our regular uh, photo uh, grabbers and senders, actually sent this one in. Wonderful shot right between two peaks right there. And despite the sprinkles tonight, a couple folks around town were having a bonfire. They wanted to share. They sent their photo to weather at kgun9.com. You can see the dog right there getting in on it as well. Thank you for sending those photos. Now we do have a little bit of rain. I mentioned the sprinkles, but it's going to be short lived and very, very light. We have a very weak cold front coming through. Actually, it'll drop temperatures just a couple degrees tomorrow. That's not really what you're going to notice. But behind the cold front, sunshine, clear skies. That will be for tomorrow after tonight's slight chance of rain across the area, 30 to 40 percent, generally speaking. So here we go. Today we made it to 77 degrees, started our day at 52. And you can see the average 46. So we were a little bit warmer than usual early this morning. Made it up to 76 in Tucson, 68 Wilcox, the high temperature. Now we haven't fallen that far. We've got that moisture in the cloud cover overhead. And that's kept our temperatures in the middle 60s here in Tucson. Still warm in par uh, portions of Cochise County as well. 62 Wilcox. We see those 50s in the southern part of that county. Uh, the dew point still, it's low. We're talking about the rainfall, the sprinkles. And a lot of them aren't making it to the ground here in Tucson. A little bit different closer to the border. A little more saturated Nogales, Sierra Vista as well see those upper 40 dew points and that means that that rainfall could make it further down. We are seeing some rain out of this though. A slight system coming through bringing some sprinkles from Drexel Heights to three points to Sal Rita right now. Even Vail seeing some of this just off to the east of Tucson right along I-10 and that will continue to move into Cochise County. So Wilcox you can expect to see some of this. Benson maybe even Bisbee a little bit later on. We're talking two to three hours from now as it moves off to the east. High temperature today 54 in Flagstaff 65 in Page Upstate. Uh, in Arizona earlier on and you see starting to cool down right now. There's clear skies off to the north in Kingman and Flagstaff, even in Phoenix clearing out right now. So they're actually going to be cooler than we will as we go into the overnight hours tonight. You can see a very sharp demarcation in the clouds. Phoenix clear, Flagstaff clear as I just mentioned, but we have the rainfall uh, around Tucson. Also the clouds that'll stick with us through much of the evening tonight. There's future cast. It shows the rain moving on as we go into the early morning hours. It will move off to the east and you see some form of cloud cloudiness over Pima County into tomorrow or Monday early morning that sticks around. We'll call it partly cloudy skies and then we get back to clear conditions as we head toward the week. So you can see mostly cloudy conditions here in the Tucson area. It's night 46 Nogales 45 Sierra Vista. You see the middle 40s in Cochise County also will stick around 50 in Green Valley for tonight and for tomorrow warming up to the middle 70s. So a little bit cooler than we saw today. 68 in Sierra Vista with partly sunny skies. Afternoon though should clear out across the area. 75 your high temperature tomorrow in Casa Grande and a little bit greater detail in Tucson tonight. We still have that 30% chance of showers. They'll stick with us tonight. Then we'll start to see those move by the wayside. We'll stay mostly cloudy though. Clearing tomorrow a little bit cooler with those middle 70s. Mount Lemon middle 50s can be expected. And here's the seven day planner. After a little bit of a rainy night tonight, we'll be back to partial sunshine for your Sunday mid 70s and then a warm up. You see 80 on Wednesday, Thanksgiving Thursday 79. If you're heading out to do some early Black Friday shopping. You can expect middle 40s with those clear skies into Friday, and then we head back down to the middle 70s looking toward next weekend. Nine Your Side at 10 will be right back with sports after this.